Hi, I'm Mike Galloway on today's Hardcore Gear Guide. We're going to talk about our dog training kit. And you're probably looking at the table going, wow, that's a lot of stuff. Yeah, it is a lot of stuff because you need a lot of stuff to help train dogs. All right, the first thing I want to talk about is the bag that the kit comes in. All right, first of all, the bag has a hard bottom. So wherever you're training, you can set your bag down. You don't have to worry about all your stuff on the inside of your bag getting soaking wet. The inside of the bag has a waterproof pocket, which is where I keep all my dummy launcher ammunition. To, again, to keep it dry and keep it worthwhile. All right, the outside of the bag has a spot for one, two, three, four, eight dummies. All right, and if you look at the bottom of the dummy holders, they all have grommets in it. So when you put the wet dummies on the outside of the bag, what's happening is the dummies are able to dry and any moisture that's in it is going to come out the bottom. Otherwise, if you put all those wet dummies inside the bag, eventually your bag reeks so bad you don't even want to train with it. All right. So again, for me personally, what I do is I stick my canvas dummies on the outside if they are wet because that gives them the opportunity to dry. I take my plastic dummies, I put them on the inside because no matter how wet they get, they're never going to absorb the water because they're made out of plastic. All right, so let's talk about what's in the bag. All right, we've shown you what the bag will hold. What comes with your kit? All right, what comes with your kit is a small all right, canvas dummy, which can be used for drags if you want to start your dog on pheasant scent or grouse scent. All right, it can also be used for retrieving for smaller pups. All right, then you move on up to a larger dummy. This is in the black and the white, again, for the flash if you're working on marks. Once you get into the water scenario, again, black and white for the flash or an all white. And we've talked about our dog dummies before. They are a octagon shape, so no matter where it ends up in your dog's mouth, all right, it's going to nestle nice against his canines to prevent him from chomping down. We're trying to have a soft mouth, okay, not a hard mouth. It's also got some EVA in it, so as you can see, it flexes. Again, you don't want to use a very solid hard bumper because that's going to teach a dog to bite down hard with no resistance. As we all know, every duck or pheasant is going to, is going to be soft and you don't want the dog chewing up your birds. It also includes a force fetch bumper. We are going to get into the force fetch bumper probably on our next, dog, uh, next uh, hardcore video. But no matter what kind of dog you have, there are four brand new puppies in this office anywhere between the ages of eight months old and five months old and the one thing that they all have in common is that every one of them is going to be force fetched it's just the nature of the business all right this bumper is designed for that exercise you also have an 18 inch lead so when you're walking your dog up to the line you have something to control your dog when you're done the nicest thing about the 18 inch lead is you can just clip it onto your belt loop and walk. When you need to put your dog back on the lead, you can pull it off your belt loop, clip it back on your dog. We even thought about the rubber bands to put around your canvas dummy so you can put, put the wings, whether it's a pheasant wing or a duck wing or a goose wing, you can put it on your bumper, wrap it with the rubber bands, and this way when you're tossing your dummies, your dog gets accustomed to having feathers in his mouth because that is a unique situation. If you've ever seen a pup or a dog be introduced to birds for the first time, he's coming back like he's got peanut butter stuck on the top of his mouth. Well, you don't want to introduce him to that on his first hunt. Let's introduce him to that before we get to the first hunt. Of course, your whistle, all of our dogs have been whistle trained. You know, one whistle sit, three whistles come and the water bowl. So many sad stories about guys that are training their dogs, all right, and they don't keep them properly hydrated. All right, or they work them too hard in the month of August trying to get them ready for, ready for September. Well, it's gonna be very simple with us because this collapsible water and food bowl is gonna be right inside the bag. All you gotta do is pull it out, dump the bottled water in there or pond water, and you're all set and ready to hydrate your dog. Again, this is Hardcore's dog training kit. It has our dog training bag, which can be bought separately. It has all of the items that we feel will help you train your dog from the seven weeks old when you bring them home to that six months old when you're bringing them out in the field. Thanks.